He's good. Oh my gosh! Get in the net. Get in the net. That's a good one. Bro, I don't have the net. What's up, guys? It's PD Fishing, and we're at the Juicy Pond today. It is late, as you can see, super calm. So, as you can see here, got us a part two of my birthday. So, we got the Shimano Zodius in the first rod. And uh, let's go ahead and unbox this thing and see what we get. All right. You ready, bro? Uh, huh? Uh, Boom. Look at there. All right. Let's get this thing unraveled here. It even comes with a rod sleeve. You see that? Look at that. Might as well just pull it out here. All right, guys. So here we got the favorite DC Dustin Connell Summit rod. Brand new. Just came out with it. Along with other tournament anglers, they put together their own favorite rods and made their own. But I decided to get this rod because I wanted a new frogging rod. And all we kind of have is just like seven foot ducats. And uh, I just wanted to get a nice, strong, this is medium heavy, by the way, seven, two, seven foot, two inches. And uh, it looks super sleek, feels really nice. For seven, two, it's really light. It's not really light, but it's, it's pretty light for seven, two. Feels, feels really good. I got this Shimano Scorpion DC 2016 model because it's black and red and it matches with this favorite rod because it's black and red. So that's gonna look super sick. It's gonna look just like that. And since it's late and it's super calm on the water, we just picked up these new 10,000 fish tataki frogs. These things look pretty sick. They got some nice legs on them. Got some nice patterns on the body. So I'm really excited to try those out because we have not tried those out before and Overall look, 10 out of 10. This thing looks sick. It's got super cool designs on it. But of the rod, got some nice foam handles. And it's got some, it's got a glittery uh, reel key right here. It's pretty sick right there. Feels really nice though. Put it to the test, we'll see how it goes. All right, boys. So where there's one, there's always two. <laughs> and I can't let Parker have all the fun. Dang right. So. I'm gonna be honest, this rod looked pretty juicy when Parker got it for his birthday, so I had to go ahead and order me one too. So there's two Dustin Connell favorite rods. That's so sleek looking, dude. I just can't get over like the glittery and like the artwork on the rod. It's so, so sleek and sick looking, man. It's a 7.2 medium heavy. Yep. Comes with a rod sleeve, which is pretty nice. That's pretty Although, sick. We've got a stack of rod sleeves sitting in the garage floor that we never use. That's true. <laughs> but uh, I have just kind of a standard Corrado DC that's got 40 pound braid on it that I'm gonna put on this for right now. I might actually put I might actually put that new 2021 Scorpion on here. Oh, true. Um, and run that. I also have 40 pound test on that Scorpion so, DC. This is gonna go on here. And I'm gonna run this teriyaki frog. Dad's gonna run the green teriyaki frog and I'm gonna run the black and red to match the rod and the reel. Teriyaki frog, 10,000 fish. Oh. It's tataki frog, we just like to call it teriyaki. Yeah. It's, it's like Night Rider, dude. Yes, sir. You're gonna, be, you're gonna be like all night ridered out, literally. You exactly, got, bro. You got a red and black re reel. Red and black reel. Red and that's the 18, rod. by the way, not the 16. Oh, okay. So that's the 2018. I got you. So you got the 2018 scorpion, black and, uh, well, it's really more of a maroon than a red, but you got your uh, 
DC rod, black and red, and then you're gonna be running that black. That's gonna be pretty wild, actually. Black and red frog, black and red rod, black and red reel, baby. That's Let's go. Pretty sick. I like that. So we're gonna get these things put together, tied up, tied up, and we'll see you on the GoPro. I guess. Catch some fish. Yep. Yes, Let's sir. Get it. Let's go. All right, guys. We got the frog, tataki, teriyaki frog, whatever you want to call it, black and red on black and red on black and red baby let's go let's go down this bank and cast parallel and see what we can do last time i came here they were munching so let's uh oh yeah some good land clearance right here there we go Ooh. first cast here we go oh yeah that feels good right there Working that frog. What if it's like really deep out there? <laughs> it's a little far. <laughs> Is it? Yeah. Alright, boys. We got the frog back. It was the water temperature. It was nice and cool though. Was it? Yeah. So in all, all theory, we should have been catching them if Carry the water was cool. That gum, dude. I was just like, I cast it, it just snapped. I was like, bro, really? And then it drifted down. Had to go get it. Dag of well, 11, $11 frog, bro. I'm not, if it's that close, if it's decently close to the bank, I'm going, I'm going swimming for it. Because when, what? When, when Genius Parker here was tying it on, he goes, oh, look, Dad. My line sprayed <laughs> and didn't decide to cut the frog and retie past the frog. I was trying to catch some fish, bro. I didn't feel like retying. Okay. Right. Well, that goes to show to uh, don't do what I do, just retie. All right, boys, today was kind of a bust. Last time I came here, I freaking whacked four like halfway down the bank. And then we come here today and just nothing. So, uh, we'll, uh, Catch you guys tomorrow. Hey, I thought we talked about this. This is our pond. It's our fishing spot. You better get out of here. Heck no, nah, I'm called the cops on you. All right, guys, I left you guys off with me going to get this frog in the water because. Yeah, kind of threw it and it snapped off. But we also have these 10,000 fish cycle baits slash underspins that we got also with the frog. So that's super juicy. And I also got some Guggen Squad 3.8 inch grub paddle tail swim baits to go on these suckers. So I love throwing underspins. I really like throwing these things because it has a blade on it also. And uh, caught that 3.5 at Talquin at the dam. So I didn't even know you had one. Yeah, I thought I had a striper, but that was a good bass. Also, we got the brand new Dustin Connell Summit favorite rod here. It's got that thing paired up with the Scorpion DC, black and red, black and red, black and red, all black and red boys. So we're gonna go ahead and get on this pond. These cows are getting closer and closer. I'm kind of scared, like what's going on? That one was in the water. That one's in the water now. And then we got this one creeping up on us right here. Well, look. This one's creeping up on us right here, so it's we... Like it's, scary. it's like a horror movie. Like every time you turn it back and then like you look over and it's like... It's closer. closer. And closer until... It's uh, like all right, all right, boys. Uh, we're not wasting any time. We need to get on the boat because they're... They're going to charge us, bro. I hope not. All right, let's, I, I let's, let's go. Let's, hit the 350, let's go, let's go, let's go. We got to go. We got to go. Let's go, let's go. All right, guys. So we got this 10,000 fish cycle bait underspin. Three eighths ounce. Mm, yes, sir. Look at that sucker right there. All right, guys, this is what it looks like. It's got a nice Colorado blade on it. Nice, nice weight to it. Could be putting these Guggen Saucy Summers on, 3.8 inches. Got a nice three-aught hook right here. Yes, sir. All right. Go ahead and grab one out of here. There we go. That looks really good. Jeez. Yeah. 
your line. Watch your line. I'm going for the eight pounder. They're all coming in, bro. Oh my gosh. What? <laughs> Got one. Yeah. The big one? Got wrecked. No, I just think it's a little one. It's a decent one. Still good on that under. Got freaking. Just working for a second. Got freaking wrecked. The hook set pretty good. On breed, let's go. Rod feels nice. It's a decent one. Yeah, looks like a four pounder. A four pounder? I don't know about that. Three, four. It's probably like a two and a half. Really? Yeah. Well, that's another decent one. He swallowed it. Look how he ate that. Yeah. Wow. Can I boat flip, you think? Should I try a boat flip? Uh, not sure. There we go. Look at there. He bumped it, dude. I mean, just boom. Like, just had it. And I reeled down. I started reeling down, and he just started swimming with it. I was like, oh, yeah, there we go. There's one. Look at that. First one on the underspin. That's not a bad one. Probably like a two. Nice little. Let's see it. Nice little chunker. Look at that, look how he ate that, dude. Right down the pipe. Oh yeah, right in the side of the mouth, look at that. Nice little grub tail right there. Nice little grub paddle tail. On the brand new Summit, Dustin Connell favorite rod. I'm trying. At least we're not skunked. Down. There we go. There we go. On that Guggen Squad 3.8 inch paddle tail. With a nice thousand, half. I 10, just, fishing underspin. Yeah. Look at that nice little Colorado, Colorado blade. I always do that. Colorado Colorado blade. Blade. Yeah, he swallowed it though. Thanks, brother. I nice just threw fish. it out. I just threw it out in the middle, and I just like I sat there and I counted like five seconds. Fish one. There we go. I counted like five seconds, and I just started reeling it slowly. And all of a sudden, I was like, boom. I just felt boom on the end of my rod. And then I reeled down. And he started swimming off with it. So that's a nice fish. There you go. Appreciate it, buddy. Right on. All right, boys. I'm gonna let this little guy go. Thank you, buddy. <laughs> there he came back up. Seriously. <laughs> <laughs> there we go, brother. No skunky. Let's go. Let's keep going. All right, let's get at it. That it's, rod, it's raining a little bit, too. Rod felt nice. All right, let's go. Yes, sir. That looks like a big one. That's oh, a that's decent a good four. That's a really good one. That's a three. Three and a half. Well, maybe not. Maybe like a little. Dude, they're choking it. That's a good fish. I don't want to hey, break. You. I'm not going to break my rod, bro. That's a good fish. Oh, that's a solid that's four. That's a three. That's, that's a good one. Heck yeah. That's a two, two and a half. It's a good fish. It's all. Dude, they're choking me. I know. Look at that. All right, guys. Another one on the new 10,000 fish cycle bait. Still on that 3.8 inch nice paddle tail swim bait from Guggen Baits. Thank you, buddy. Yes, sir. All right. You ready? Ready. Let them go. Boom. There we go. Good job, man. Let's go, Fish bro. one, that's three. Good size this time. They're all We're good actually sizes. getting some size right now. That's awesome. I think I've caught nothing but like two and a half. Yeah, we're getting some good size out here right now, which is really good. I change. might have to change over to that cycle bait soon. Yeah, they're good. They're, it's that nice big old Colorado blades. Dude, it's going good right now. Whoa. Crack that is. new Justin Connell Summit Rod, baby. Feels really good, dude. Nice, hard hook sets. How's them BGs? Look at that. Get, the, get that on camera. Look at that. Look at that right there. Can you see it nice? Look at that freaking action right there. They can't resist that. That's why they're freaking swallowing it, boys. How are the bubble guts doing you? Oh my gosh, dude, it's so bad. I'm gonna have to sit, I'm gonna have to lean over the boat, boys. Let's keep going, let's keep fishing. I mean, these are the realities of fishing when you fish all the time, like, you know, there ain't yeah, no- Yeah, when you uh, take me to a freaking restaurant like that, bro. Yeah, there's no, uh, like, public restaurant. Well, it is kind of a public restroom out here. It is. Honestly. 
You shouldn't got no toilet paper. <laughs> well, I got some wet wipes in the truck now. In the truck? <laughs> We're not at the truck right now. It's not that far away. It's over there. All right, let's get back at it, boys. It's a good one. Look at him running. It's a good one. Let's see it. Pull him up. Oh, yes, that's sir. A good one. That's a good one. Yes, sir. That's a good one. That's a, that's a four. Oh, that's bigger than a four, I think. Let him break that rod. Holy cow. Oh, my gosh. That's crazy. Don't let him get hung up in the motor. He's a good one. Oh, my gosh. Get in the net. Get in the net. That's a good one. Bro, I don't that's a good have one. the net. That's a good one. That is a good one. Bring oh him over here. Oh my gosh. Bring him over is here. Is that Betty? Bring him over is here. That, is I that Betty? Betty? I got him. I got him. <laughs> oh! oh. No, that that's is. A, that's a, no, it's not. That's not her. That's not her? No. That's a good one, though. Golly. I told you. That's a good one. Holy <laughs> cow. Look at that. Look. Dude, you are the luckiest guy in the world. Guys, we're literally going in because I got a, you know, number two. And I was like, let's, <laughs> I was just like, I'm going to cast it out while we're going and just, you know, troll it. Look at there. <laughs> what's that a nice, what's that, five? Five, six, or five to you six, you want to take yeah. it over to the truck and get the scale? Where, where's the scale? In the truck. Is it in your bag? Yeah. Yeah. We got to get, we got to get, get in the water. We got to get Instagram. Oh, yeah, get in the water. Oh, Put my gosh, water. dude. Let's go. That's another, dude, that's another fish that's not the same fish of any other one. Farm pond caught. never fails, bro. That's, the, that's not, that's a different fish. That's not the five pounder. I'm the underspin. That's probably like a, what is that? Well, maybe, that's, I think that might, that's either like it's high. A, it's long. That's either high fours or like right at five. Oh. All right, guys, we had to go back to the truck to get scale. That's what she looks like. Go ahead and get this. Here we you go. You have to pull the boat up on shore because I'm floating out. Uh -huh. There we go. All right. Let's go ahead and get this weight on her. You ready? Is it going? I'm just probably gonna say like five, five, two, five, three, something like that. Oh my gosh, it's almost a six, six pounder. pounder. Well, look at that belly though. You see that belly? Yep. Look at that. Look at that, dude. All that right. Girl right there. We're gonna take it back out where we caught it and let it go. Yeah. All right, guys. One last look at this. Basically, six pounder, five fifteen. Turn it this way more. Nice, good fish right there, boys. Look at that belly on her. All right, we're gonna get her back in the water because she's she's been under a good bit of stress. So, thank you, baby. Ready? Give her a good little kick off right here. There she goes. She's kicking. There she goes. Come on. Come on. Come on. There she goes. Boom. Let's go. Fish bump. On the way. Just trolling it, dude. Let's go. All right, boys. Whew. Dude, that's six different fish. That's yeah. six different fish. What is going on right now? I'm trying to tell you. Wait till, wait till pre-spawn. Pre All right, guys. Well, that's what? Four, nine, five, six, two, seven, four. And that one was just five, 15, basically six pounds. That's five different fish that are freaking good size in here. And there's, I'm sure there's more. More so, importantly, tell us how it felt on that new Dustin Connell rod. Dude, it felt, it felt good. It felt fine. It felt good. I just felt I just felt some dense weight and I just hook set and then all of a sudden I just felt them pull back and I was like okay that's a decent fish because you know when they pull back that's a good fish and I didn't think it was that big until he jumped I was like oh shoot and then like he went under the boat and I had to go like all the way down but it felt really good I'm gonna be honest Definitely with you with not gonna with every, flip that one with everybody that uh Everybody that says favorite's trash and that it They break off. easy. I mean, if there was ever an opportunity for that to break when it went on a boat, it should have broke that tip that, It off. should have, honestly, because I didn't I didn't have any drags. Like, my drag is just super tight. So that, I mean, 
it I mean, held it's up. It's good right now. Yeah. Held up to a six pounder, dragging you under the boat. Yeah. That's so. Crazy. All right, boys. I don't think lightning's gonna strike twice, so I'm gonna. <laughs> go hey, back you never to the know, GoPro. bro. You never know. Yeah. Do you have one? Yeah. On the freaking head, dude. I must have thrown it on his head. As soon as it landed, freaking. Is that a good one? Oh, that's a pretty good one. It's a decent one. It's coming out of the water quite a bit. How close is he? It's right here. It's probably a little three pounder. Nice little fish. He freaking wrecked it as soon as it hit the water, dude. That's a good fish right there. Oh my gosh. <laughs> We're just catching digs out here. You're just catching them, dude. Holy cow. Look at that. That is no shabby fish right there. It's freaking choked it. All of them are choking it. <laughs> That's, That's a nice three. That's at least a three. There I go, dude. Look how he ate it. Freaking ate it. Always oh, bleeding. Always oh, bleeding. Oh. All right, guys. So I literally just casted this way, and like as soon as it hit the water, all I felt was boom. So I reeled down, and he just, I just felt it just bob, and I was like, oh my god. He must have grabbed it when it was heading, like when it was on the sink. Yeah, I was like, holy crap. It was all on right. the fall on me when it was falling. Nice fish. That is a nice fish. Oh. And the release. All right. Well, he's wanting to go, so there you go. All right. <laughs> All right, guys, fish and bump, the release. You're catching some good fish on this underspin, dude. You're catching some good fish on it. I think you got the secret color right there, gold blade. Dude, I told you to put a bigger grub on it. Dang. All, All right, right guys. we got a few more. I don't want to be loading more. this boat in the dark. Yeah, we got a few. We got a few more minutes, and then we'll be getting out of here. But that's six, and we caught some good fish out here today. We have, dude. Everything's been at I least over I just two had pounds. One. I was like, what the frick? Everything's yeah. at least over two pounds right now. Yeah, they've been they've been freaking just. Absolutely. Yeah. Swallowing this thing. All right, guys, we're getting off the farm pond and it is dark, so we're gonna wrap this video up. Overall impressions on the Dustin Connell favorite summit rod, brand new. This thing is pretty slick, pretty sick. It's really slick. It's got a nice glassy finish to it. Super cool design on the rod. It's got a nice, good size butt of the rod. And I mean, Overall durability, really good. I caught a daggum six pounder on it that took my whole rod under the daggum boat. But uh, yeah, as long as it's in one piece, then we're all good. So yeah, 40 pound braid is what I caught that six pounder rod. I caught that six pounder on the 10,000 fish new cycle bait, that big old Colorado blade on it. This thing is pretty sick. I caught four fish on it and a Guggen Squad 3.8 inch grub paddle tail, little swim bait. So yeah. Caught that on a Scorpion DC, black and red, to match the black and red on the rod. Looks pretty daggum sick. So yes. If you're new to our channel, make sure you go ahead and hit that subscribe button. Hit that notification button so you get notified when we upload. We got the giveaway still going. S likes DC on a Guggen Squad gold rod. We're like 30 away, we're not far at all. So make sure y'all hit that subscribe button so you can catch some biggins just like us on a new combo. And uh, yeah, PNB. We outie. Till then, boys. Keep slapping them.